get your teeth ready. You might get some chipped teeth. <laughs> Better wear a mouth guard. <laughs> Would that be efficient, though? Wearing a mouth guard for oral, probably. I mean, think about it, though. You wouldn't, there'd be no teeth. It's actually not, that's not the worst. You might be onto something Ooh. with that. A mouth guard during head. Dude, how many f***ing weird business ideas do we come up with on this? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like with the mouth guard, though, it eliminates one problem but causes. What do you mean? It would, like, lock, like, scratching you, but I feel like you wouldn't be able to, like, I don't know. You loot some space? Yeah. I mean, is that really a problem for you? <laughs> Yikes. Okay. <laughs> well, I was just saying that. I was talking about other. I was just saying that. I was like, talking I that for <laughs> other guys would lose space. Okay. I'm trying to think of most people, not me. <laughs> My God. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. Oh, don't leave me. The wave like they know us. These bitches on parade when we show up. Moonshine. Not moonshine. What is this called? Apple pie? Apple pie. It's apple pie. Oh, there it is. Yeah. This this is perfect, bro. This shit's good. Thank you. Uh, mm. If you want to warm up any apple pie moonshine, you're more than happy to. Yeah. If you want to warm up my apple pie. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Dude, the best part of our last podcast was us just being like, oh, horny. Ah! Can't be horny. <laughs> Can't be horny. We're trying to kick it. Trying to kick the horny. Yeah. No more... No yeah. <laughs> bonk bonk. No horny November. We need no horny November. <laughs> wham wham wham. We should do. What were those old like YouTube Oops. videos that used to pop up? Uh, like I know PewDiePie did one where he's like, every time I cuss, I have to like take a shot of hot sauce. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that would that would curve my horniness a lot if I didn't take a shot of hot sauce. Every time you're horny, you just yeah. take a sake bomb. Not to go into it, but I do have a video of me chasing a shot with Sriracha. Yes. <laughs> do you actually want to see it? Yeah, I do. Fuck! Okay, okay, you, okay, okay. What? <laughs> I, I did not know you did so many weird, like, shot combos in oh, college. Oh, yeah, bro. I only remember you taking, like, the, like, pre-workout and, like, beer or something. Like, you shot oh, that beer. one too. <laughs> That's the only one I remember. I didn't know about all these other ones we've been, like, no. that been popping up. Do we show that one, too? I think we've shown that one, but but I feel like we have to. We do could it do again. it again, especially because I mean, Evan texted us. I totally forgot. Yeah, about that. we we could do it again. I don't. I don't care. All right, all I right, have all no right. agenda. Rewind. I remember how I laid out this entire episode, and now we're just throwing it out the window. Yeah, there I it like goes. It. There I it goes. Like it. Okay, a couple of things here before we dive into that. First off, number one, welcome to the number one podcast on OnlyFans, guys. Make sure to do all the things that help us. Does that mean do you want to do your your little thing? Yeah. Um. Don't make it horny. I won't. If I you won't. make it horny. <laughs> C- clutch or kick. Yeah, clutch or kick. <laughs> clutch or kick. Um, <laughs> instead of trying to sneak in to your steps. Oh, that's horny. <laughs> that's horny. Wee woo. Kick. <laughs> kick. I mean, kick. No, instead of doing something, like, just like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> instead of doing, instead anything, of breathing. Yeah, instead of, like, just doing anything. Photosynthesizing. Yeah. Uh, scratching just your nads. Your like, nuts. comment, subscribe on everything. Every like, time. comment, subscribe. Turn on post notifications. Um, LCC. Shit. Dude, I should have written down which one it was. Keep stalling, keep stalling while I'm looking for this. Thing. LCC, everyone. That's like, LCC. Comment, subscribe. Oh, wait. LCS. Oh, like, I comment, found subscribe. it. I'm so LCS. good, bro. I'm so good. My Dialed. dick is too fat. Too, too fat. fat. Dick too fat. Okay. <laughs> um, To start off the potty, guys, I we've, on all of our podcasts, like, one of the other call to actions that we've had is, like, yo, like, on Spotify, we leave down this, like, poll this like questions section i pretty much tell people like use it like a comment section and you can do this on youtube you can dm us on instagram like whatever you feel comfortable with like we're here to play um drop like some funny shit like we've yeah. wanted we want you guys to get absolutely heinous in the comments yeah, like, <laughs> we can take it i want we, war crimes we, in our comments we do right? enough yeah we do enough shit on people that i think i think it's totally fair game to yeah you guys can shit on loose. us let you guys loose. You guys can tell your funny stories. Yeah. Because, um, and like, tell your stories. I mean, our big thing is Lil Pee Pee Boys, you know? Yeah. yeah. Matt, we both peed our pants before. It's, it's our pants. Started down here. Now we're up <laughs> we're here. Start- <laughs> we started down there, but now we're up. <laughs> now we're up. Started peeing down, but now we're up. <laughs> <laughs> so everybody's rocking the back end of a bad, uh, a bad cough. So yeah, sorry, every guys. time he laughs, it's going to be like he just did a. Whole carton of six. Yeah, that wasn't as funny as it probably sounded. I just yeah, that laugh turned into a cough. Yeah. Um, but someone, uh, you know, I don't know if we should say this person's name. 
because it's, it's it's like it's it's through Spotify. Yeah, um, we're good. but someone left on our uh, which podcast is this? Someone left on our you can fit this in your peach emoji <laughs> podcast number eighty nine. They said, when the pandemic first started, I used to take very long walks. This one time, I was two miles from home and I had to piss so bad I couldn't walk. I just pissed my <laughs> pants and walked home wet. No. Hashtag, hashtag little pee pee boy. Oh, no. There was no <laughs> attempt to like, oh, yeah, because you can't probably go into like restaurants or anything no everything was closed and yeah. they were like two miles yeah, away you couldn't be like you couldn't i'm, I'm assuming there's not can next you, to it like a forest during the day so you'd have to yeah can yeah. you imagine just accepting your, your fate feet? like that like, oh my god like just like you're like trying to just like, pray <laughs> that like she's wearing like black pants or that he was wearing black pants or something not, yeah not like a white it wasn't like a white pants kind of day based off the name i think it was a girl yeah but, like, um, I just want to know, like, how much piss. You know what I'm saying? That's a tough walk. Because I, I don't know. Do you feel like girls pee, like, the same amount that dudes do? I have no judgment on that. You've <laughs> never, like, listened to your girlfriend, like, peeing and been, like... Like, I've listened to, like, girls that I've been seeing, like, pee, and I'm, like... You, there's the, you, That took you, like, three seconds. I mean, I probably heard it, but, like, I don't save... M- the storage in my brain does not go to that. Oh. I do not save... <laughs> that, that's where, that's where my brain goes. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just like, bro. When I pee, like, I be peeing for a long time, like at least like, at least twenty seconds. Okay. But like, I don't think I've ever heard a girl pee for twenty seconds. Yeah, I don't know. It's always just like, <laughs> maybe a couple dribbles. Are you like, like that dribble? Are sound? you like ear pressed against <laughs> the door, like listening? <laughs> yeah, I actually hide in yeah. girls' bathroom, just like. Oh, here. Just like he's taking, just taking <laughs> notes. I want to. Starby's just like doing research. He's like literally just like writing it down in like an Excel sheet. Like, hmm, interesting. But yeah, I want to see a scientific study on this. I need someone to be like, yeah, average. Should we Google it? Average. Yeah. Length of for it. Female. Yeah. Just. What is yeah. it called? Piss. Or just do like average piss time. Average. Ad- well, we. It's the difference between like. Who, who can pee guys. longer? Yeah, who can pee longer? <laughs> the ultimate. No, I can pee longer. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we'll step. This is what we'll start the gender war. Bro, I bet you can't even pee for ten seconds. <laughs> Fucking loser. <laughs> Fucking beta male. <laughs> God. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> that was like we were playing Call of Duty yesterday. Oh my god! <laughs> Why did I say this? I was like talking to Zebby, and then we got like put in this this whatever, and like in a lobby. In a lobby, thank you. <laughs> and, and I was like at the tail end of saying what I was saying, and this dude's like, "Oh yeah, bro!" Like, I don't even yeah. remember what I was saying, and then I just was like, "Yo, bro! Like, you can only can you even poop your pants? Like, I can poop <laughs> my pants." Like, just, yeah, he was just like talking trash about the last game. <laughs> And then we were just like, yeah. It's I want that energy, though, with what we just were talking about, though. Like, bro, I bet you I bet you can't even pee for 10 seconds. <laughs> Can you imagine this fucking dude, like, s- squares up to you at a bar, like, ready to fucking fight? And you're like, yeah, bro. I bet you can't even pee for 10 seconds. There's fucking no Fucking loser. There's no way you lose that fight. <laughs> Your bladder. He backs down right away. <laughs> My bladder is way bigger than yours. I'll piss all over I'll you. I'll piss all over you. <laughs> that's like that's like Blue Mountain State. Have you ever seen that? Well, no, I've seen that show. Oh, okay, I just, I just don't know. What, what do you mean? Isn't that the show where the guys like? Um, I haven't seen it in a while. Where the guys like uh, shit? I forget what the premise was, but like he was it, like someone had told him like, oh, like if you're about to get in a fight, like just like talk mad shit and just like say crazy stuff. Oh like, yeah, Sammy. And then Sammy, yeah, yeah, Sammy and then was saying that someone's like about to fight him he's like bro i'll jerk you off yeah <laughs> I'll, yeah. I'll pull your pants down. i'll jerk you well, off right now <laughs> didn't, didn't like didn't someone go like well what happens when they pull down their pants and you're just like i'd assume i jerk them off i don't know <laughs> i'm so sorry <laughs> sorry he's done over here i told you before we started too i was like yeah. Dude, i'm gonna be hacking on yeah. this shit you, st- you were like if you, i start laughing i start coughing instantly the laugh turns into a cough um what was I going to Google again? Uh, <laughs> how long, like, the average oh, like, right. male. You know what? That seems like a rabbit hole I don't want to go down right now. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Sarby. You got this. I'm trying, bro. I'm trying. Got let, me this. This, let me get this water. 
<laughs> Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard that gulp. <laughs> Are you watching football? Yeah. <laughs> I was just while you were choking, I was like, I might as well watch the the Eagles. The Eagles, just, the Eagles just won. So. <laughs> Bro, like I said, the the present, the not present husband. Yeah. <laughs> in that one podcast when we started. <laughs> Oh my god, bro, this is rough. Yeah. This is really rough. I gotta stop laughing. Okay. Um, yeah, thank you guys once again. Thanks to that person. I'm not gonna say their name. Yeah, for and I feel like putting that in. Congrats, sh- you've been inducted to the the little pee pee boy hall of fame. Yeah. Wouldn't that be insane like if we had like a little pee pee boy hall of fame? Yeah. I like that. We should make that. Yeah. We'll go, I we'll like get, that. We'll get cracking on that. We could definitely get cracked. <laughs> <laughs> Little PP Hall of Fame. Little PP Hall of Fame. Okay. A couple of things we want to do on this podcast. Um, definitely going to show those videos. I might have to do a little bit of the searching for those videos. I thought that's what you um, said you found. You're like, I'm so good. No. No, no, no. The oh. little uh, PP boy story. Oh, okay. I thought you were talking about the video of you taking the shot. No, but I can go try to find that if you want. I will. I definitely it doesn't matter to I, me. That's I th- what I thought you meant because we were just talking about that. I mean, I think what we had to do, because remember on the last podcast we were going through the piercings that people wanted us to Google? Yeah. Um, and there's another one because there were four okay. total. So we've only been through one. Yeah. And I think we should do one more. But okay. when I was talking to you about this, I think we should try to draw it beforehand. Oh, God. Yes. And then... Draw it after because we can't put it on the podcast, no. but we can draw it. Yeah, 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 yeah. And show it to YouTube, Spotify, yeah. something like that. If you're a visual yeah. listener, yeah, right. if you're a visual viewer, yeah, if visual you're a viewer, not listener, or if you're a viewer and listener, you're listening, you're viewing with your ears. <laughs> the like X Files. Yeah. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. <laughs> okay, so I have drawing pads here. Oh, we got little notebooks here. Got little notebooks. Oh, I see there's pens. Too. Oh, yeah, you want to take a pen? Take a pen. Take a pen. Six by nine. I'll take go. a pen is. Yep. <laughs> so he's like, all right, I'm done with Horny. you. Horny. Horny. Wee woo. Okay. So, Zemi, are you ready for this? Yeah. I'm going to lean my phone against your moonshine. I mean, your apple pie moonshine. What makes something moonshine? Uh, Well, like, I think this is just, like, fake moonshine. Oh, okay. I feel like real moonshine is, like, where you, like, you like have to like brew it. <laughs> yeah, Basically, it's where you're like distilling, uh, like corn and shit. Yeah, I can't remember why. Like, is can't moonshine make you go blind or something? If you use wood chips, some use like wood chips. Yeah, because then it'll release like methanol. Like kids' wood chips from like a playground. Yeah, yeah. Oh, crazy. Because usually I think you use like corn, I assume, or some sort it's of like corn. barley. And then, but I think some people would use like or would mix in wood chips, or they used to. But it, like, releases a chemical that'll... <laughs> make you blind? Yeah. Nice. Sick. The but things no, that's just, do for that's alcohol. Just, yeah, Crazy. That's, that's just Everclear. It's not... Oh. It's not actual, like, moonshine. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah. Blackout. I, I don't have... Everyone's favorite blackout right there. Yeah. Everclear. All right. So are what, you, are, what you am ready? I drawing? What am I drawing? You are drawing. So this piercing, keep in mind, it's a dick piercing. Okay, I'll draw my dick. Yeah, draw your dick. <laughs> okay. This one is called Jacob's... Ladder. The piercing is called Jacob's Ladder. I don't know what you envisioned in your head. looking pee-pee. I know, bro. (laughs) (laughs) What was that noise? (laughs) Okay. I'm just going to draw here. So here's the shaft. Yeah. Um, Fuck. And then we're going to... We're going to have to remember to to erase these because these are definitely straight candids. And this imagine so like they're bad. like, oh, let's use the notepads, and then they just see dicks. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like a middle school. It's like, it's like you leave your you leave your notebook on like the table, and they like, come back, and like these middle school boys have just drawn dicks all over it. <laughs> all right, this is what I'm imagining. There's like little. <laughs> Mine's oh, so bad. Mine's so bad too, bro. <laughs> There's going to be, like, a little smaller one right there. All right. Ready? I don't know. <laughs> All right. All right. Show, show, show it to, like. All right. 
Here's what mine looks like. Wait, but like turn it so I can see it too. Like to the and camera. And then here we go. Okay. Oh, okay. I think we have like the same idea. Kind of same idea. Yeah, mine's Dude, I like, like th- that your your dick has like a smiley face yeah, on it. Yeah, made a little smile. <laughs> <laughs> made mine happy. I don't even know if like the cameras can see. Yeah, I don't even. Hopefully they can. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> I went for the rings. You went for the the ladder. Okay. Like it's like a ladder. Yeah, it's like bars. Like a, it's yeah. like a dick ladder. You know. Yeah. I mean, and this would also kind of fit what I was talking about. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like imagine if your like your dick had like little like ridges in it. That's basically what my premise was. Was like, yeah. has anyone made a rib dick? And this is probably pretty close to a rib dick. It's a yeah. ladder. It's a ladder dick. Yeah. All right, let's see. All right, so we're we gonna like look up what yeah. it actually is. Okay. We're absolutely. We're gonna look up what it is, and then we're gonna draw it for the audience. Okay. Oh, fuck. Uh, uh. Yours might be pretty accurate. I don't even know if we'll have to draw well, it again. Yeah, maybe. Oh, what if we're like... Yeah, spot on. What if we're both right? Like, mine are like bar... Pe- or mine are, yeah. Like, I'm thinking like implants more. Yours are implants, not like just little metal bars? Okay. Yeah, that's more what I meant. But it could okay. be maybe little metal bars. Okay. Yeah. Um, Jacob's. Guys, the moment of truth. <laughs> Can I can I get a the what what is it the the the, the, the drum roll? Can you oh. put like your mic in between your thighs and slap them for me. <laughs> <laughs> Not the salmon. <laughs> 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 oh my god. <laughs> I'm a little hacky boy today. Why does Google want to use my my location? Oh. I mean, we weren't <laughs> we weren't not wrong. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, the tip part I is that a Coke can on the bottom, <laughs> or like a little tab? It looks like a tab to a can. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think that's like the piercings that because you wow. did the round piercings. Yeah, and yours. I, did the I bars. think yeah, I think you were pretty close with how it. Yeah, actually, I kind of like just yeah, more. Yeah, with the bars. All right, so here's what it looks like, guys. It's my drawing. <laughs> But with like, yeah, little bars, right? Little yeah. bar, like, yeah, they have little. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, and then there were like circular piercings on the sack, which also extremely painful. Yeah, probably. Wait, would you say? Would you say this does it justice? Yeah, 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 I think that does it justice. Yeah. There we go. I think this is, this is the Jacob's ladder piercing. Yeah, nice. It's basically what I drew, but with. Balls instead of like, like kind of like balls on the yeah. end of the, pier- of like the metal bars. Yeah, yeah totally. Totally. Yeah. And then, like, I mean, I'm sure there's different variations, but yeah. like, that makes sense. Yeah. Ladder. Ladder. I guess it kind of makes sense. Yeah, you climb up that. <laughs> if you can climb up it, whatever you want. <laughs> Do you think that would hurt if you were giving head? Just like, uh, maybe. Like yeah. metal yeah. bars? Hitting your throat? Or like your teeth? Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Ooh, I didn't even think about the teeth. Yeah, I don't know. I think anyone has ever been giving head to like a Jacob's Ladder penis and then like chipped a tooth? I wouldn't be surprised. Imagine going to the dentist. You're like, yeah, how did this happen? <laughs> so how did this happen? Uh, Do you know what a Jacob's Ladder is? Here, here's, there's this podcast here. Just watch this and I'll show it. They have a good picture of it on there. They drew a great picture. Yeah. yeah. So that hit my teeth. Phenomenal artist. Yeah. Phenomenal. Artiste. Artiste. I guys, I I'm giving up the influenza and I'm I'm becoming an artiste. All right, what's the next one? Dicks. Um, that was it. I think we're gonna. It was just that one. We'll just do this again next podcast. Oh, okay, cool. There's more. Do you cool. want to keep? No, no, no. no I like I like. No, I think we we can be done with dicks. <laughs> we today. can be done with dicks. The dick up, ep- the dick uh, portion of this, the dick segment. The dick segment. <laughs> oh yeah, we gotta throw this away. Otherwise, there's the a pee pee segment. There's we don't a need dick s- segment, don't need which this. sounds like the same thing, but it's not. <laughs> Shoot this. See if I can make oh. it a trash can. Oh, Kobe. All right, we got a trash can. Kobe. 10 feet away. 20 feet. Kobe. Ah. <laughs> 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 Shut up, Nate. <laughs> I, th- I think it was like the full like. <laughs> and then just like, <laughs> yeah, and then it's not even going half. Oh, yeah, I guess I didn't even get to see it, but it just like. It, it just like. <laughs> wee. It's also a piece of paper. It wasn't very heavy, you know. <laughs> oh, that was good. Well, that was fun. Um, delightful. Delightful. We do be looking at dicks sometimes. 
I love that I just opened my phone and there was a dick right there. <laughs> just for me to look at. <laughs> Screenshot, add to favorites, send it to the family group chat. <laughs> Whoops. W- oops. <laughs> oh, sorry, guys. Wrong one. <laughs> sorry. Wrong family group chat. I mean, what? What? Whoa. whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> send it to my girlfriend. Oh, sorry. I meant to send that in the family group chat. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, uh. Shit. <laughs> Hey, yo, babe, should I get this? <laughs> get your teeth ready. You might get some chipped teeth. <laughs> Better wear a mouth guard. <laughs> would that be efficient, though? Wearing a mouth guard for oral, probably. Would. I mean, think about it, though. You wouldn't, I there'd don't, be no teeth. I feel like that's. What if ma- someone made a it's mouth actually guard? Actually, not. That's not the worst. We might be onto something Ooh. with that. A mouth guard during head. Dude, how many fucking weird business ideas do we come up with? On this? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's so funny shooting this in front of Nate because Nate is like married with a wife, like like super like straight arrow, and then Debbie and I are like dick, stick, 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 stick. I just like seeing Nate's like focus, and then just like just seeing him just break when whenever we say something, just really, really out there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there you go. Everyone needs a little degeneracy in yeah, their Yeah, you got to like ring out the rag every once in a while. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. You got to en- you got to enjoy <laughs> yeah. the stupid things in life. But and th- we are Yeah. We are the stupid. We could be that for we you. C- we could be We are that for you. We are the stupid thing in your life. You're welcome. I think Tell your parents that. <laughs> I feel like with the mouth guard though it would like it eliminates one problem but causes like some other problem probably. What do you mean? Well like it would like block like the teeth from ever like scratching you, but I feel like you wouldn't be able to like you'd lose up I don't know. I feel like you it lose some space. Lose some space? Yeah. I mean is that really a problem for you? <laughs> Yikes. Okay. <laughs> Well, I was just saying that. I was talking about well, other. I, just say that I was like, talking that for <laughs> other guys would lose space. Okay, I'm trying to think of most people, not me. I'm, I'm not. I'm talking. I was gonna say I'm putting myself in that hole too. Like, she <laughs> can have a mouth guard on. I think she'd be okay. <laughs> My God, <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. That was a good one. Oh, don't leave me hanging. That was a good one. <laughs> that was funny. Oh. Yeah. oh. Oh, I don't know what's wrong with me, bro. I am sweating right now. I am like coughing a lung up every time I laugh. Like Sarby's dying. I'm he's, dying. Sarby's dying, but he he's not gonna miss a podcast shooting though. Exactly. Never, never, never miss that. It. Okay, but before I die, let me at yeah. least show you guys all this blackmail that everyone has on me. What blackmail are we looking at? Um, I'm trying to pull up. I think I know where the if I can find Evan. Evan and I's interactions definitely know the video of me. There's a okay, so there's a couple videos. There's a video of me like mixing in. I used to like work out, shower, and then go to the bar. But before I would go to the bar, I'd make like a protein shake that was like water and vodka. Oh (laughs) man, and then like the whey powder. Yep. Oh God. Yeah. That's fucked. Look. All That's I have so, to say is... Would you, and you do that regularly or just like once as a joke? I wouldn't say regularly, but I definitely did it more than once. Yeah. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because yeah. it was just like a meme. I like That's put on my story so and people would be like, you're fucking stupid. And I'd be like, yeah. maybe I am. <laughs> just maybe. But, um, but the story that Evan, or the one that Evan's thinking of is there is this really fucking funny video of me where... Um, For Halloween, do you know, have you heard of bro science? Yes. Where it's like OBGYM. Yeah. That's one of their (laughs) (laughs) t-shirts. Yep. So he's like, his like persona, this isn't his real name. I didn't even know this, but his like persona for that channel is Dom Mazzetti. And he's just like this like gym bro. Yeah. All of his videos are super funny around like, like the toxic gym community. And it's so funny. And I went as him for Halloween and there's this video of like, I don't even remember. (laughs) I don't even remember why I did it, but Evan was just like, yo, let's like film this and like I'll record it. And it's literally like me, like putting, I want to say it was pouring 
alcohol or something into a full ass pre workout like container. And I don't think all the pre workout was in there, but it was yeah. just really fucking funny. Yeah. And like me just like chugging and like pouring it all over myself. Wait, was it vodka or was it just water? Wait, you were pouring. I honestly don't remember. Um, fuck, man. So I just you don't... poured like straight liquor on yourself. Maybe I'm trying to remember honestly. That one, that one's a little foggy because I know we were getting ready to go out. Yeah. So that's the only reason why I'm like, why wouldn't it have alcohol in it? Kind of thing. What year did we? Wait, what le- year did I live in the barns? Junior year. Yeah, like 2019. So that would have been like October. Yeah. Of 2018. Yeah, I think so. Sounds about right, at least. Oh fuck! It's not here. I think Evan has it. And it's or it's on my old phone. Did you go through Fuck. your texts with Evan? Um, in the media. Yeah, I did. It didn't okay. show up. Okay, that's so sad. Well, okay, the one that I could sh- pull up is the the one from Padre of me taking the sriracha shot. How does that sound? Compromise. We'll compromise, we'll compromise. With, <laughs> with, the, with the sriracha shot. That's what we're all about here at Sarby Studios. Is yeah. compromise. What stupid idiot? Oh, here we go. What stupid idiot thing am I going to show Matt today? I love it. On this week's episode, Sarby, being a fucking moron. I'm going to save this real quick. Hold on. Uh, Download. Dude, why is Snapchat, like, infinitely more complicated now? Uh, Yeah, I don't know. I feel like they made everything harder, and they're just trying yeah. to compete with TikTok. Like, where are you trying to, like, 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 where, almost, like, how to navigate it. Yes. I feel like such, like, a dummy. Like, I just, like, where, like, how do I find, like, the... Where everyone shows everyone's location. Like, how do I find, like, my saved stories? Like, yeah. Like, I actually have to, like, think. I'm like, all right, like. Ooh. Like, they're turning into, like, Facebook. Oh, do I not have sound on this? Oh, apparently there's no sound on this video, which is massively disappointing. But, oh, shit. Here you go. All right. You might have to swipe to the left and hit play. There you go. Okay. Yep. Oh, God. <laughs> Out of the bottle, too. That is uh, nasty of me. <laughs> yeah. Kind of sus. Wrap your lips around that thing. Or did you suck in a little? Yeah, I had a mouth guard on, too. <laughs> Dude, you're looking good in this fucking video. Oh, thank you. You kind of look like a baby, actually. Bro, that was... that. I know, right? I do look, like, super young in that. Yeah. That was when I was, like... Working out two hours a day and playing hockey for, like, yeah. an hour and a half every day, too. Jeez. Like, I was going crazy. Yeah. Um, no room. Yeah, never again. So never a fucking again. But, yeah. How, yeah, would, you, was, how would you rate that sriracha shot? Do you remember it? Yeah. I don't know. I think I'd have to do it again. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It could have been, like. That was Padre. Like, yeah. I was already, like, pretty drunk at that point yeah, when you I already had that. You just, something about Padre's air. You just, like, get, like, a shield. Dude, Padre. Inside your body. Padre was just, I. It feels like another world, like another planet. I still another can't, lifetime. I still can't believe that the story you told about um that w- you guys running into Steve Aoki, mm-hmm. and she was like Steve Aoki, Steve Aoki. <laughs> yeah. That was like episode eighty five. That something is with TV. That, that is such a good. That is such a good one, dude. That was so <laughs> good. I have, so, I have so many like funny pod. I've told. I may have told it way earlier, but I've told you the story of when I found the dude on on the side of the the street. Like, he, like, it's, I don't remember why. I think I was, like, talking to a girl at the bar or something, and everyone, like, left. Mm-hmm. And I was like, cool, I'll just, like, walk home. I'm not that drunk. And so I was walking back, and, because it was, like, bar closed. It's, like, 3 in the morning. And this kid is going the opposite way from, like, the houses. Like, he's going, like, towards the hotel, towards the bars. Mm-hmm. And I kind of, like, looked at him. And then he, like, looked up and looked at me, and we made eye contact, and he just, like, points at me from across the street, and he's like, <laughs> do you know where I am? <laughs> 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 and that, that was like, all right, well, now I'm a fucking dickhead yeah, if I don't yeah. help this guy. Like, this yeah. guy literally is like, and he's like a college kid, like, oh, whatever. Yeah. And he's, like, clearly has no fucking idea, like, what's yeah. going on, where he is. And this is, like, this is actually the night before we're supposed to, I'm supposed to get up. And vacate out of our Airbnb and drive back to Iowa, like, the next day. Oh, so, God. And you stay up till 3? Fuck. Wait, just wait. Yeah. So, I see this kid. 
I go over and I'm like, yeah, bro, like, where are you staying? And he was like, I'm staying on Venus Street because in Padre, there's this row of streets that are named after the planets. Oh, okay. And the only reason I knew that is because the day before we had ran, run into some friends who needed a ride back and they lived on one of those streets. Yeah. And I was like, oh, that's really interesting. Like, they named yeah. these streets after just the planets. By chance. Yeah. Yeah. And so just like, yeah, by chance, I was like, first off, he was going the opposite way. Yeah. Like, yeah. the streets were that way and this yeah. dude was cooking it's it this nice way. It's nice that, like, in Padre, like, it's, like, one main street that goes, like, east to west kind of thing. Mm-hmm. But then, like, and, like, that's the one that goes, like, hundreds of miles. Yeah. It literally just, like, ends because, like, sand dunes just, yeah. like, go into it. But, like, the streets that kind of go, like, north-south, they're only, like, five, ten blocks long. Yeah. And then, like, they go across that main way, so. Totally. Yeah. No, like, Padre was pretty simply set up, but, like, yeah. this dude was, like. But, yeah, if you're blackout drunk, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's true. He was, he was pretty drunk. Because. Yeah. So I'm like, I actually know exactly where that is. Let me walk you back. And the whole time, the dude's like, yo, bro, like, please don't rob me. Like, I don't have any money on me. He's like, I got, like, $200 in Venmo, but, like, please don't Venmo it to yourself. And I was like, dude, I'm not going to rob you. I'm walking you home. (laughs) I would have done that a long time ago. (laughs) Yeah, I was like, if I would have robbed you, you would have been, like, knocked out in a ditch already. Like, I don't know. I don't know what you want from me. I wouldn't waste my time getting you home. (laughs) (laughs) So... This kid, I walk him back, um, and, like, we get to the house, and there are these dudes, like, chilling on the balcony, and they're, like, I don't even remember what the kid's name was, but they're, like, oh, like, James, we've been looking all over for you, and I'm, like, okay, clearly well, not, because y'all, no, y'all, y'all, y'all are <laughs> you up guys there are chilling. just partying it up, right? Yeah. And so, uh, they... They, like, take them in, get them into bed, and they're, like, so thankful. They're, like, oh, bro, like, thank you so much. Like, we appreciate you. They're having, like, a full-ass party up there. Yeah. And I was, like, oh, and they're, like, yeah, we just got here for our spring break. There were some, like, frat guys from Alabama or something like that. Oh, my God. And they're, like, yo, you want to, like, stay here? Like, well, we got you some drinks. You got our boy home. And I was just, like, I was, like, fuck it. Like, last night here? (laughs) Yeah, I do. Uh, Shit, I wonder if I have this screenshot, but there's a... There's a screenshot that I sent Tiki. Um, oh, you know what? It's in our group chat. It's in our group chat with Tiki that oh, we've okay. had for the podcast where um Damn it. It's so nice of them to be like have a drink with us real quick. Yeah. Before you head out. The least the least we could do is give you a drink. Damn, where is it? We've been looking everywhere. No, you guys haven't. <laughs> Absolutely you have not. Well, let me let me see if I can send the text message. But it, it, like, I because I was like, yeah, I'm gonna hang out with these guys, but I don't know. Like, I don't know if this is the move. Oh shit, who was? Oh wait, yo, tell me why. Yeah, Tiki I know. Just, just texted, texted us. us. He's back. <laughs> Tiki just texted us because he's coming into My boy's town. Back. Is this the group chat that he sent it in? No. Okay. Either way, I don't. I don't know if I want to find it, but um. Uh. I think I sent, like, Tiki out of the blue. I sent him, like, a text message. I shared my location with him, and I was like, just in case I get kidnapped, or just in case these guys kidnap me. Yeah. <laughs> or something like that. And Tiki just sent me, like, a big question mark. He was like, what the fuck? Because he had no idea what was going on. So I'm hanging with these dudes. Like, they're drinking um, Rockstar, vodka Rockstars, because Rockstar, like, yeah, trolls the beach yeah. and just drops yeah. them. So yeah. made, they made this crazy mixy, which if you have like caffeine and vodka, it's just like not yeah a for healthy lo- for mix. loco territory. Yeah, it'll hit you when you least expect it. So like I'm just having a fun ass time, like till like five in the morning, yeah. and then all of a sudden I realize I'm like I have to get up in two hours. Yeah, and start to drive. This drunk is hitting me hard. Yeah, to the point where I was like, uh oh, I might be a little sicky boy. So I, I, like, dab all these dudes up. I'm like, thank you guys for having me. Glad I could get your boy safe, yeah. home safe. But, like, I got to dip. Yeah. I'm, like, walking back, and I just feel the demons coming Oh, up. God, yeah. And I almost made it home without puking. But as I was rounding the corner onto our street, yeah, I just, like, felt it come, and I ended up, like, puking in, like, an empty lot. Yeah. Where, like, someone <laughs> yeah, was going to build a house yeah. or something. And I was just like, no! But that the rest of that night, I was, like, up, like, trying to, like, get the demons out. I only got, like, two hours of sleep that night. Oh, God. But that was just, like, one of those, like, weird, like, 
oh shit, I like found their boy. Yeah. And like because of that, the night actually was like yeah. pretty fun. Yeah. Like, <laughs> well, a little afties adventure. A little afties, which is funny too because at that time in my college life, that was like very out of character for me. Mm-hmm. And like those moments, I think I like appreciate the most because I'm like, okay, that's like, yeah. I very much don't remember a lot of like the playing the hockey or like yeah. that kind of stuff that like kept me from those activities. But I remember that story. Yeah. <laughs> that story was fun as fuck. <laughs> Like, going to Padre was fun as fuck, too. Absolutely. Do you have any good, like, spring break stories? Where did you go for spring break? I don't even know. I went to Padre once. Yeah. Um. God, I'd have to... Uh, I'm have sure... To it. Yeah, I'm sure there are. I can't... I just can't think of any. Um. I feel like all the ones that I have are just, like, my intrusive thoughts of, like, that was funny. There was, like, one where, like, I tripped over a plant and, like, cut open my leg. Or something, and I like remember walking past the next day, also hammered. I was like, "It was that plant. Like that plant was the one that tripped me." And like everyone was like, "What?" <laughs> I was like, "See this scar on my leg? It's from that plant." <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys beat the shit out of the plant? I wanted to, <laughs> but no. We had a pretty, we had a pretty mellow. I guess like when the <laughs> when cops rolled through and like you had cops roll through on yeah like Padre. Yeah, they like yeah. What? Yeah, so we were we were all staying in. Did you guys commit murder? Like, no, we I were feel just, like they never. It was can. like a noise. It was like a noise complaint thing, and then they just rolled in, like trying to like, kind of scare us and stuff. And so, they rolled in and like, was like, all of you are getting like all these charges or whatever if you don't pour out your booze right now. And I started like pouring out booze, and, like literally cracking open my own handles and like pouring them out. And everyone was like, oh, wee woo. And after, and then like they literally were like going. They they were just. Like bull rushing us, like, like you're all gonna be arrested if you don't pour out your beers, like all this stuff, like coming in hot, and like I was freaked. I was like, "Fuck, I'm fucked." Like it was like day, like it was like the f- within like the first two hours of being there. Really? It was insane. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. And out of nowhere, they just left. Out of nowhere, they just wanted to scare us and like get us to pour out some booze and like leave. It was so wild. The only and I was like pouring out like all of my handles. And then everyone looked at me and was like, you're a fucking idiot. (laughs) Dumb, dumb baby. (laughs) Dumb, dumb idiot boy. (laughs) Fuck. But, uh, yeah, it was, that was, that was a eye-opening experience. (laughs) Just kind of saw everyone, like, at their, like, most panic stage. Yeah. Obviously, I just folded and was like, yeah, I'm just going to fucking crack my handles and pour them out like I don't. And then there's like some people who are like, you don't have the right to be on this property. And then there was just like some people who were like, I'm just gonna like kind of like chill, s- chill and sit here and like just pretend like I don't know what's going on. And then like kind of like reassess the situation in ten minutes, <laughs> like <laughs> See, fake, uh, but like I fake would... f- pouring out beers, like yeah, 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 and just like kind of just sitting there like pouring out like an uncracked beer sort of thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was. And then I'll and then literally ten minutes of them just like break an entry, just, like, screaming, and then they left. See, I would be with you, though. Yeah. I would be the same as you. I'd be like, oh, oh kids, I was like, it. fuck, like. Dude, I'll, when when I was in Padre, that's the only experience I've had with an officer while I had alcohol. We went to one of the bars where it's, like, it's 18 or older, but, like, when, if you don't have a 21 plus ID, they put an X on your hand, and yeah. I didn't want to use my fake ID yeah. that I brought because, A, it was, like, it was one of my our fraternity brother's old IDs, and it was, like, Clearly fake. Yeah. Like, just the biggest fake on it, it said I was 26. Yeah, like, the, fake, it was, the fakest of the fakes. The fakest of the fake. But people were like, in Padre, they don't care. And I was just, like, too, wor- too like yeah. nervous to use it. So we go in. I get the X on my hand. But then Evan was there. And Evan was like, I'm going to buy you a drink. Like, what are they going to do? Yeah. And I was like, oh, yeah. What are they going to do? So we're walking through the fucking crowd. I literally have the drink, like, in my hand like this. Like with the yeah. hand that has yeah. an X on it, and we're walking, and all of a sudden, just just like so, like it was one of the bars that was like right next to the ocean. Yeah, like it, it had yeah. like the what is it called, like a porch dock. Yeah, balcony. Like a dock I don't know, thing. dock. Yeah, yeah. and um, um, we're walking kind of towards that edge, and all of a sudden, I'm like at the back of the train, an arm just comes right in front of me, <laughs> and I look over, and it's this like police officer dude, just like standing there. And so I'm holding my drink. We walk eyes. He looks, he like looks at me, looks at my drink. I look at my drink. I look back up at him and I go, uh, 
I'm holding it for somebody. And he just doesn't say a word. Grabs the drink, throws it over his shoulder, puts the empty <laughs> cup back in my hand. And I just, I looked at him. I looked at him and I was like, and I just Fair walked enough. away. Fair <laughs> enough. Dude, I, I actually remember that moment when um when we, we went to like probably the same bar, honestly. Um, when I went and I think it was called like Joe's or something. Yeah, I remember like running into the bathroom after they put it on, and I just spent like ten minutes like just fucking like <laughs> wee woo, wee woo. making my like <laughs> fucking back of my hand bleed trying to rub it off, and I think I got it off for the most part. Um, but yeah, they 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 have like the fat permanent marker, and they just give you a yeah, big they give you like X. the fattest X on yeah. your f- on your hand. Yeah, yeah. but good times, man. No, nah, dude, that that was great. Like. I think highly recommend Padre for spring. Oh, yeah. I think you have to do it once and then yeah, realize like yeah. you're too good for it. Realize like, like yeah, you never need to do that again. Yeah. Yeah. I did it once and like slept on a pool floaty for a week and like my like in between slash like buffer snack was just like a box of cereal I bought. Tiki and I shared a twin bed <laughs> in Padre. Jeez. <laughs> that, was, that was bad. Jeez, that yep. It was pretty rough. It was pretty rough. But I mean like there's only so many times in life. That you can experience that. Like, that's yeah, why, too, yeah. I always tell people, like, I feel like when you live alone in college, you're missing out on a time when, like, you should be living with roommates. Yeah. If that makes sense. Yeah, like, you can live alone forever. Exactly. Yeah. You have all the time in your life to live alone, but, like, in college, it just, like, hits different. Like, yeah. going down in the kitchen, like, after, like you know, Sunday after going out, like, mm-hmm. making some pancakes, debriefing with the boys on, like, yeah. what the fuck happened. Like, yeah. that was some of the best times in our apartment that we yeah. had was just, like, yeah. us being fucking idiots. And, like, yeah. in a lot of ways, I, like, miss it a ton, especially because we, like, it got cut short because of COVID. But at, at other times, I'm like, that was the time for it. Like, yeah. I, I could never do that It was now. so good. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Now that we're adults and we have to, like, do adult shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, totally. And I think still, I mean, even still now, it's nice to have that kind of debriefing, Yeah, you know, after the weekend with a roommate. But you got forever to live alone. No need to cut that, uh, start that early. You need to cut it. No, nah, definitely don't cut it, bro. That shit is, that shit's special. Yeah. Shit's special. Mm-hmm. All right, well, I literally cannot find this video let me check uh, Evan and I's like text messages really quick, but I I cannot find it. I cannot okay. find it for the life of me, and I'm pissed. It's okay. It's about time sh- for the Vikings game to start too. So yeah, exactly. Maybe we just hit like Roll one more that. quick quick boy talk. Although this one would be so quick if I could just find the fucking video, dude. I'm so pissed. It's just like one of those videos that's that's like so stupidly iconic. Um, okay, we can just skip it and then. Uh, maybe bring it on for ne- next week. Yeah, if something you could, for you yeah. guys look forward to next week on the potty. Yeah, yeah, agreed. Yeah. Aligned. Um, aligned. Let's see. Approved. Let's do this one because I feel like we were gonna try to hop on to "Am I the Assholes" Reddit threads, but I think we should mm-hmm. save that. The yeah. one that I I just thought was fucking crazy um, was I was listening to this podcast and they were talking about how this dude like donated his grandma's body to science. Like, to this company that, like, is like, yeah, we'll, like, mm-hmm. do research or, like, we'll sell it to people mm-hmm. who will do research on. I think the grandma had, like, Alzheimer's or something. Mm-hmm. And then somehow the dude figured out that his grandma's body was sold to the military to be tested, to have bombs tested on it. Like, they blew up his grandma's body. Yeah, that's, that, they're the asshole for that. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty fucked. That's pretty ass- fucked. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that crazy? Oh, my God. Yeah, that would be I, I if they did that with I wouldn't want to know. But if I found out I'd be pissed. No, straight up. That's straight so up. But also that made me think a little bit. Like what do you want to do when you die? Like what 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 is the like I was thinking about this. I was like Well, like what do, what what I want what do I want my family to do with my body? Yeah. Or maybe even, yeah, just like in general like what what do you want your family and friends to do with your body? I just yeah, I'd probably want to be cremated. I know like I'm Pretty sure in the Catholic faith, you're not, you can't do that. But oh, are you Catholic? I'm, I'm technically confirmed. Yeah, I mean, me too. But yeah, I don't, I don't <laughs> practice too much. But yeah, I, I, I would rather just be cremated than be like, try to figure out a place where I could spread the ashes. Sort yeah. of. Yeah. I just, I, I don't want to like. This is so dumb, but like, I think, I think there's a very good purpose for, you know, like graveyards and like, stuff. But I just think they take up a lot of space. <laughs> 
like a lot of useless space. That's what I was saying. Like it's cool to have like the tombstone that like people can visit and like talk to you and stuff or on those on those sort of things, but I don't I don't I seriously don't want to take up space after I die. Yeah. <laughs> just want to like here just like sprinkle me around and I'll just Or even like have you heard how expensive those funerals that funeral shit is? Yeah. Yeah. Dude, those coffins are not cheap. I no. was like just for me to rot in, like, no. I'm Straight up. Yeah. I'm like, dude, when I die, like, I just, like, you could, you can just cremate my body and kick my ashes as a curb, bro. Like, I don't. Yeah, I don't even. I really do not give that. I don't, and maybe like that's, a, like, our generation, Yeah, too. and if there's, like, a place where, like, you want to spread them and then put the tombstone, like, that's fine. Yeah. But, no, I just see, like, the, like, the humongous, like, cemeteries. And I'm like, would you, would you, fast. like, do, are you, like, are you an organ donor? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. See, that's where, that's where yeah, I, I take was, my organs and just, like, or whatever's left. Yeah. That see and that's where I was like I don't know, like technic I don't know. There's I was reading the article. I don't want to like dump, like bore you guys with it, but basically I think the short version of it was like obviously the guy signed something that was like we can do whatever we want with this body. Yeah. But it's like in, in his mind he was yeah. like, "Oh, anything related to medical stuff." Yeah. And to me that would also be an honorable way of like in my opinion, like Get like you know when you die. Yeah. Like hey, if I have Alzheimer's, like study my brain. Yeah. Maybe in the future, mm-hmm. you guys that'll help you discover something, right? Yeah. But like, to fucking like blow up someone's fucking. Yeah. <laughs> First off, that's it's just little, crazy. Yeah, like, it's a little like, unsettling. Let's see, imagine the military being like, ah, oh, shit, we need to test this new bomb out. Hey, yo, can you hit up that company to buy a body? Yeah. <laughs> like, what? Yeah, the exchange <laughs> of that, like the. <laughs> The the market for Is that, that a business write off? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll take a uh, four dead Sar- grandma. Sarvi makes like <laughs> can see you just making like an unpack <laughs> an unlike packing video of that so you can like write it. <laughs> All right, guys. So just, just got day. this body to blow up, but <laughs> I need it to be a write off, so I'm making this YouTube video about it. Like, hope you guys like it. What is up, subscribers? <laughs> Welcome to the video. Um, today I'm going to scare Zemi by putting a dead body in his locker. <laughs> <laughs> it's just you opening it, like ah, ah, ah. Like, is that you real? got pranked? Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if they get them for free or if they have to like pay for them. The military? Yeah. Absolutely have to pay for them. Yeah. I wonder how much they make. <laughs> <laughs> I think in the article it said it was like five grand or something like that. Jeez. But I mean, that's also the the crazy part too is they, he donated it. Yeah, and then they made money off it. <laughs> I mean, entrepreneur. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stonks. Stonks. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Fuck, man. Uh, I thought it said like $5,000 somewhere in here, but maybe I'm, maybe I'm. Not smart. That could definitely be it. Oh, that is a different article. Dude, I hate these, like, news sites because they, like, give you a half, like, half of the story and then they try to get you to read other ones. Yeah. Like, fuck off. Oh, this was in Phoenix, too. I didn't even really realize that. That's so crazy, bro. I want to know how he figured out that he sold it. It doesn't really say. But, bro, can you imagine that? Like, be pissed. I would be pissed, too. And then it's, it's like, also it's, it's almost like, like it's too late, too. Like, you can't do anything about it. Yeah. Sorry, bodies exploded. Yeah, I, I don't know. The guys on the podcast were, like, not necessarily arguing, but they're like, oh, like, I mean, but, like, she's dead. Like, what's the difference? And I'm just kind of like, ah, I don't know. I feel like I yeah. wouldn't want that to happen to my, like, dead grandma. Yeah, no. You know? Like even, Again, even like if I knew ahead of time, I would. Yeah, have been like, I'd no. rather I'd rather like never know that, even if it did happen, sort of thing. No, totally. Yeah, totally. But I do have to say, I feel like on the flip side, just putting your body, even just cream, like I don't know. I've been always thinking about this. Like, is there something more productive you could do after you die with your body? You know what I'm saying? Other than like organ donor, you know, like yeah, I, I'm an organ donor too. Turn into like fertilizer for a tree. I don't know. Well, that's no fun. Well, trees are. I want cool. I want my body to like cure cancer. You know okay, what I'm saying? Well, <laughs> you're expecting a lot of your dead body. You know what? I should. I keep my my alive body and my dead body to a high standard. Yeah. And this body w- had me sick 
all last week. Yeah, and, and I'm fucking pissed about it. <laughs> so maybe, so you, you know, maybe what? you do want your body to <laughs> be a bomb dummy. Someone, someone, call, can I like pre-sell my body to the government? That is a phenomenal question. <laughs> Yo, you try to make five bands real quick? Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Like, always beep, paper beep, chasing. Bring, like <laughs> always paper chasing. <laughs> well, it's like one of those YouTube videos. What's like, up, guys? <laughs> I'm here to show you how to make 5K in under 10 minutes. All right, step one, sell your body to the government. <laughs> Call up the Department of Defense. <laughs> step two, tell them you want to sell your dead body. <laughs> they will wire you cash instantly. Guys, this is the easiest thing Cash to do. now. Easier than feet picks. And then he, and then he <laughs> pulls up, like, just make sure to use my promo code, <laughs> at Zemi, <laughs> to get you a 50... <laughs> 50% discount on your first body. Sign your friend's bodies up and get a, another 50% refer, off. Refer a friend. Refer, refer a friend. For just use my extra. promo code. <laughs> <laughs> uh, bro, you literally made me like kind of blow snot out my nose a little <laughs> bit. That one was funny. <laughs> <laughs> the creator codes. Oh man! I'm just imagining like Mr. Beast being sponsored <laughs> <Yeah>. by like <laughs> the Department of Defense. Go to sellyourbodyright.com right now <laughs> and use promo code Mr. Beast. <laughs> I'll be giving away ten thousand dollars to whoever Signs to the up. first hundred people who donate their body to the military yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or sell their body to yeah, the military. <laughs> Not like actually, like you fuckers who join the military, yeah. like that's on you. Yeah. But I mean, you your guys are dead yeah. body. Like. Yeah, <laughs> cash in advance. Oh, that's so funny. That's crazy. But wouldn't that be like? I bet you could. I need to look into that. That'd be interesting. next business idea. Yeah. God, Big this never stops. Fucking brain. Do you have to pay taxes on that then? Oh, that's a good question. Probably. Well, if it's government. True. Is that how that works? I don't know. Couldn't tell you. Can I we think just it, say how that was work. Yeah, sure. Bro, we know. Yeah, we're genius te- geniuses, bro. I want a financial advisor. Just <laughs> <laughs> don't say that. Don't say that. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Little pee pee boys get sued for bad financial <laughs> advice. <laughs> I just watched um Pepsi Where's My Jet on Netflix. Yeah, Nate's got it. Yeah. No, what is that? I don't know what that so is. So basically Pepsi ran this campaign it, when they were trying to like during like the cola wars in like I think the 90s. And they rolled out this new Pepsi stuff. So it was just Pepsi swag and you could turn in points that you got from buying cans to get sunglasses, bags, t-shirts, oh. etc. And they had a whole catalog. But at the end of um the commercial it's this guy like landing at a school in a Harrier jet, and it said for seven million points, you can get a Harrier jet, but they didn't put like anything at the bottom, kind of being like, yeah, that's a joke, oh. sort of thing. And so it's like this guy like was like, all right, like he like figured I want out, that. yeah, and so he figured out that um, you didn't necessarily have to buy that many cans of coke he was reading in an article or he was reading in like the catalog at the end like the terms and conditions um because they had like they had like a stand set up in like gas stations of like kinda yeah like the contest or whatever yeah and so there's like a catalog he looked through it and at the end it said that you could buy points so then he figured out it was like 15 cents per point if you wanted to like instead of buying okay. a can of Buying a six pack and you getting just buy the points. Could buy the individual points. Oh. So he originally was like, "Fuck, it's gonna cost me like three million dollars to like get those points buy, from buying stuff." Yeah, buying the stuff, and then he had to figure out like storing the stuff, unpacking, like ripping off the tags. But then he found out what does this do guy have to do for a job? Like what? I don't know. But then he <laughs> found out that you can just pay for the points, and then it made it like only like seven hundred thousand dollars to get the jet, and so he like. They, like, filled it out, and it's, like, the whole story about how that went. Pepsi was like, yo, we were just kidding, bro. Yeah, like, but they, but, like, it was a legitimate offer sort of thing. So that was, that was his, like, argument. But mm, um, mm. 
it was so interesting yeah it was it was really good i thought it was super funny i love that have you ever seen i love when people get fucked over like that have you seen the monopoly one no how like remember the, the monopoly games that mcdonald's did yeah have you seen that no oh my god so like this the the like they're Cause I mean, the whole point was like you can win like yeah. a dick ton of money. Yeah, and so what what happened was like the guy in charge of the tabs that McDonald McDonald's outsourced that like game to. Yeah, he would like steal, not steal. He would take like the most Whatever. valuable ones, yeah. and then he was working with like this Italian mobster to like, hey, we're going to like give this to your family members. Yeah, so that they can cash in on it, yeah, and then, like, we'll all make money kind of yeah. thing. And so, like, that whole Monopoly game, like, people weren't actually winning. Yeah. It was, like, every person was, like, selectively chosen. Wow. And they started realizing, they're like, wait, like, this person has a connection this with person. this. Like, this is, yeah. like, this Italian mobster's wife's friend's nanny. Yeah. And, like, this person is, like, this Italian mobster's like brothers, cousins, sister, like all this shit, yeah. and they were like, everyone was just like, "What the fuck is happening?" And yeah, it was because of that. I don't know. I that just I remember winning, that. like, yeah, remember those sweepstakes are so wild. Like, I feel yeah. like they always just turn. Well, into it, I mean, like, you can even see it, like, in like sweepstakes now, sort of like when people are like, "Oh, like, I'll give you a Lambo if you like do this thing," and like, you know, even the YouTuber ones are like super fucky. I've always been like really like. I don't know if I've ever seen, you think you would have seen, like, a YouTube video that was, like, I want a Tesla from David Dobrik. Yeah. Like, I don't a think. A lot I'm of people get fucked over in those. Really? Like, yeah, because, like, they'll be, like, yo, like, we're giving away a Lambo. And, then like, the person gets the Lambo, and then they're, like, okay, so now I have to pay, like, you know, in California, I have to, like, put it through admissions, like, mm -hmm. I have to pay for the tabs, I have to pay for the insurance, and it's usually, like, a fucking, like, 18-year-old. Yeah. Insurance for a Lambo and for an 18-year-old is, like, through the fucking roof, and then, like, it's just, like, it bankrupts Well, them. I wonder, because I've never read the terms and conditions, but isn't there, like, with uh, those game shows where it was, like, what well, was behind door two, and it's, like, a luxury vac vacation and a boat. And then, like, after the show, they're like, well, actually, we can't give it to you because there are, there's all these terms and you yeah. don't fit this term that, yeah. like, you didn't do three backflips when you won it or something like that. And then, therefore, Probably, they yeah. didn't actually win it. But they sign an NDA that requires them not to go and talk about it. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't know that they did that. But, yeah, usually, I mean... If it sounds too good to be true, it, it probably is. Totally. So totally. I remember, I think it was Drew Gordon. He's a YouTuber. Did like a, or no, Danny Gonzalez or one of those two did like a video about giving someone a Tesla. But instead they figured out like how to like give someone money with like, or like a Tesla without like fucking them over. Mm -hmm. um, Cause I mean, that shit like puts you, that can put you in a different tax bracket. Too. Oh yeah. Like, it just like, you know, you, like you think you could generally be trying, you could genuinely try to do it and it just inadvertently fucks that person over. Yeah. So. Well, I mean, it's not cheap to probably have a Tesla. Yeah, no. Insurance is probably through the roof. Yeah, so they did. he did a whole video about how, like, he tried to, like, make sure and, like, talk to his, talk to lawyers, talk to financial advisors on, like, I want to give someone money, but I wanted to, like, not actually fuck them over. Yeah. Or a Tesla. Totally. So. Crazy. Good video. All right, brother. Good yeah, let's wrap here. it up. Yeah, let's wrap it up. It's so about, we can uh, watch. It's Skull, it's Skull o'clock. Skull o'clock. Oh, yeah, it's way past Skull o'clock. All righty, guys. Appreciate y'all. Thank you for listening to the number one podcast on OnlyFans. Make sure to follow us at Not Sarby Studios, at Definitely Not Sarby Studios. You can follow him over at, at Zem Daddy. That's Z E M M D A D D Y. We should get you back on a posting schedule. I feel yeah. like you never post on I, there. Dude, I have. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll figure something out. We need to like have like a meeting and be like, all right, let's ha how do we touch pee -pees, You know? Yeah. Um, but you can follow him at Zem Daddy. You can follow me at Ben Starbacher. Uh, appreciate you guys for listening. Yeah. We'll be back next week, every Friday. Mm hmm Touching tips, being horny, all that shit. But we're trying to not be horny. No, I'm always horny. Okay, well. It's no horny November, so. Bro, you're sick. <laughs> you're like sick in two ways. More than one way, you're sick. You're right, you're right. Mm. Mm. Nut. <laughs>